Okay folks, this is a quick update using HARP to check out the increasing solar threat. Uh, first, we take a look at uh, the Digisons and they are showing extraordinarily high critical frequencies in our F layer. Uh, basically, this means that more solar plasma is penetrating through the magnetosphere and getting down uh, through and really charging up our ionosphere. Take a look at the total electron content. We're about 30% higher than uh, what we'd call average uh, without a CME spike. Come over here to the induction magnetometer now. These little disturbances you see down here are known as PC1 magnetic pulsations. They happen between 0.2 and 5 hertz. And they're due to ion cyclotron waves generated in the magnetospheric plasma. Uh, essentially electromagnetic instability often happens in the recovery phase from a geomagnetic storm. Uh, so basically, uh, what this means is we're all charged up, and there are actually some scientists who see a correlation between PC1 magnetic pulsations and earthquakes both two weeks uh, before and after, so good thing to keep an eye on that. Um, another thing you have to keep an eye on is uh, the fact that we are in this recovery phase from the geomagnetic storm, so luckily Sunspot 11339 uh, has calmed down a bit um, and won't uh, pound us too much more. Uh, last but not least, folks, we did a nice little interview with Matt Emery from LeedSkonen.com. If you're interested in all in Coral Castle, Magnetism, Ed Leedskonen, uh, it's fascinating. you got to check his site out, and it's a pretty cool interview. We'll have it linked below. Be safe, everyone.